Hi guys, welcome to my house and Francis Xavier says hello to and welcome to the Our Story Scarborough Filey and Whitby project. Now this is week five of our vlogs and today I want to talk to you about something that will make people remember your story. It's called resolution. Resolution is the end of the story. It's solving the conflict that we set up earlier. Now, do you remember that I told you that a story is like a car journey and that conf the conflict is the petrol in the tank? Well, when we go on a car journey, we need to end up, we need to finish somewhere really, really interesting because that is what will people remember most about our story. So we've got to make the ending, we've got to make the resolution of the conflict something really, really grand. And one of the best ways of doing that is having your character use their superpower to solve the conflict. So as I told you last time, that like Cinderella's conflict was with her mother and her stepsisters to go to the ball. Well, when she gets to the ball, she uses her superpower. And Cinderella does have a superpower, although today in real life we won't consider it that much of a superpower. But in stories and fairyland, it's considered a big superpower. And that is the ability to love and forgive. So because at the end Cinderella does manage to go to the ball, she meets a prince, she falls in love and she forgives her sisters and that leads to her becoming a much loved queen. Jack in Jack and the Beanstalk uses his own superpower and you know what Jack's superpower is? His stupidity. Everybody thinks he's an idiot and because he is stupid he takes risks that other people wouldn't even dream of taking which makes him go up the beanstalk in spite of the danger that might be lurking at the top and when he runs away when he steals all the gifts and he runs away he actually chops down the beanstalk everybody else would have kept on running until they got away from the giant but not Jack he is foolish enough to grab an axe and chop down that giant beanstalk so that's the end of the conflict and because Jack has been courageous, along with being stupid, he ends up with a treasure and he gets rid of the giant that's been terrorising the country where he lives in. So now you must think of how to end the conflict using your character's superpower. Now I have got a secret to tell you. If you want the story to go on after the ending, after the conflict, you have to start it again. That's called a twist in the tale. And the twist in the tale is a hook to keep the readers coming back for more. So say, for example, I wanted to do a sequel to Jack and the, and the Beanstalk. I would have his mum sending him to the market to sell some chickens. And guess what? He meets somebody who gives him five corn kernels for the chickens. Can you make up a story with that? I think you should stick to your own stories. The ones I've been seeing on Facebook have been incredibly good. So... Good luck with your stories, guy. And just to finish, the resolution is the ending. It's bringing the conflict to an end with a character using their superpower and also things they have learned during the journey, during the story, to come to a happy ending with a twist in the tale if you want the story to start again. See you later, guys. And thank you very much for listening.